Hey guys, we have Deeks here, the standard poodle who just got dropped off. He came in on a gentle leader, um, but his family was still having issues with him pulling, reacting on leash. We're gonna go ahead and get him switched over to a 2.25 Herm Springer prong collar right off the bat. So he has that on right now. We got it fitted properly for him. Again, always high um, up on the neck and nice and snug. And what I want to do is teach him the concept of pressure and release. It's not something where we're gonna go out on the walk and he's just gonna understand what the tool means. We need to explain that to him right off the bat. So, so many people will ask us that. What do we do the second we put a tool on a dog? Well, this is exactly kind of what we consider the prong collar dance. So all I want him to do is when he realizes pressure's on and he comes towards me, the pressure is gonna be released immediately. So it looks kind of funny and kind of wonder, you know, is this even doing anything? It is because we're having a conversation with the dog and teaching them a concept that's gonna then prolong them throughout the training process. So let's see how he does. Tiny pressure. Yes. Yes. So even that tiny turn towards me, he gets that release and pressure. Yes. 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 You can already see that right off the bat, he starts to kind of wonder, all right, what are we doing here? What's going on? Good. Yes. It's a new feeling for him. Yes. So he's going to kind of potentially protest here and there. Now he's starting to already get into the mode of following me. Yes. Good. Yes. Yes. So as minimal as this process seems, we'll probably do this for a good 15 minutes of just introducing him to what that directional pressure means and how he can turn it off and that's just continuing to come towards us. So as small as this looks, this is a super important moment for you to do with your dog so that you can clearly introduce to them what that concept means and don't just put a tool on them and expect that uh, they're gonna start walking beautifully. They need to understand what that means for us to be fair to the dog. So this is gonna be a process that we continue for a little bit longer. We might, might start introducing it to them on place as well and then once it warms up a bit, we'll also introduce it to him on the walk. So stay tuned as we help Deeks become the best version of himself. Thanks guys.